the role of music and dance is uh, primary with us. Uh, everything that we do uh, is music and uh -huh. dance. We grew up with fiddles and guitars and dancing and eating and visiting. My people have always loved to have a good time, even when they were in their buffalo hunts, they'd have gatherings where they'd have music and dance. All the friends and neighbors would get together, and they had small little houses, but they'd move everything and, and dance and visit and just have a really good time. Cigars were smoked in those days, so they took the cigar box and they made a fiddle with it. I think what they're trying to get across to these gatherings, that how much fun you can have with the whole family. You know, little kids, to grandmas, grandpas, you know, and in between. The indigenous women that taught the fur traders, the trappers, how to survive in the harsh winters of the north. Without them, they would not have survived. Yeah. They didn't even know how to make snowshoes when they came. They didn't know how to make the heavy winter clothes that you have to wear uh, with the hides. Their food was very, very plain. Mostly okay, yeah. wild yeah. game. Be deer, elk, uh, buffalo. They, they grew gardens. Yeah, well, they, they had yeah, gardens. Potatoes years. was very, very yeah. important mm -hmm. to them. A lot of it isn't written. It's oral history. We didn't have anything written down. It was passed down from grandparent to grandparent to grandparent. And now it's being passed on to our kids. To be Michif. Mm -hmm. If you've got one drop of Michif blood, you're Michif. That's the way it is. And you're welcome. You're always welcome. Our doors are always open. Uh, our food, our music, our dance, always there. Sundays is always, we have church in the morning. We have gospel after that. Then we dance and sing the rest of the day. And just like you see what's going on in there now.